Hello and welcome. I'm Bill Skladowski from the blog of the same name, BillSkladowski.com, where we do leadership skills development and communications coaching for network marketing professionals just like you. It's Mindset Monday, so that means time for another mindset video. Ideas to get your mind working, maybe amp up your game a little bit as you enter this brand new week. This week's idea is don't let your excitement ruin the show. <laughs> what does that mean? Well, as a lot of us get involved in network marketing, it's exciting. It's a brand new career for a lot of us. It's at least a new way to uh, get out there, meet people, generate some fun, generate some interest, help other folks with parts of their lives, and yes, make some money for ourselves along the way as well. And all of those things are great, exciting features of the network marketing profession. Yet, for some people, they overdo it, right? You've heard of that concept of oversharing. <laughs> it's kind of popular nowadays. You see it on social media a lot. Well, with uh, network marketing, there's the possibility for oversharing and overexcitement. And some of the authors, some of the network marketing gurus also call that the verbal vomit. I'm not a big fan of that. But you know, it's like when you're just dumping on people, it's like, oh my God, oh my God, this is the greatest thing. You gotta try it, you gotta see it, you gotta join the, stop, stop it with that. It's, it's just, you know, it puts people off, right? I'm sure you know that, but I don't need to tell you that, so what do you do? Well, in the words of uh, one of the big time authors and gurus in this space, Eric Worre, he says, and I love this, the truth is enough. Let that sink in just a little bit. The truth is enough. What you're doing has meaning, it has purpose, and it helps people in some way or another. No matter what your product is, no matter what your service is, the whole idea behind being in business is, after all, to help people, right? I mean, no matter whether you run a, a, a legal office or an airline, you're helping people do something that they want to do, whether it's fly cross country or, you know, take care of some legal matter. I don't want to get into that. But what I mean is the truth of what you are doing with your business is more than enough. We have products, we have services that help people with specific things, and then you talk about them. They've really helped me. Perhaps you give a story, you know, you do a little testimonial or whatever you choose to use as far as showing people the value of your product. Maybe, maybe if someone is open to that, you give them the full presentation to that. But again, you don't want to be forcing that on somebody. You want really to attract people to you that, you know, have shown an interest and are open to that sort of thing. So remember, the truth is enough. What you're doing, what your company does, doesn't have to be hyped, doesn't have to be the greatest thing since sliced bread or even better than sliced bread, doesn't have to be any of those things. It just has to be what it is. I'm sure your company has great products or great services and they help people in a lot of ways. Talk about that. Talk about how it's helped you. The truth is enough. Okay. That's enough for this particular Monday. If you have questions or comments, feel free to leave them here on the page somewhere. I read and respond to all of them personally. If you're uh, on the blog, please remember that you can sign up for our newsletter list so that you are kept up to date with all the latest videos as they come out. We're really pushing and making an effort now, three new videos each and every week. So it's a lot of work, but we think it's gonna help a lot of people and that's what this business is all about. So once again, I'm Bill Skolodowski from the blog of the same name. Thank you for watching. We'll see you again next time.